welcome to nature with jag having a little walk around the back of the uh, building which i haven't done for ages and ages and i just found this lump of fishes in the middle of the pavement right here and according to my expert natural knowledge this belongs to a fox i believe we have a fox coming around uh, probably in the dusk or the dawn and uh, yeah we have a fox excellent It always makes me wonder how all this litter manages to accumulate around here. I mean, look at it all, man. Terrible. We have graffiti. The world's just going to pop, man, isn't it? Terrible. Ta da! I've escaped. I've got a song on my head that I'm going to uh, transfer over to my A track. It goes like this. I didn't want to be a junkie, but I've got an addictive personality. I didn't want to be a junkie, but I've got an addictive personality. Do, 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 do. Well, indeed, folks, a bit of a mixture of a video today. Um, just bits and pieces. And, of course, the uh, the football last night. Honestly, we're halfway to work and Rosie suddenly goes, My phone! My phone! I don't have my phone! I've missed all of them! So I've had to come all the way back. It's now quarter to six, folks. Good morning everybody, this is Wednesday. Now today's exciting task is to go and score some envelopes. I need to send stuff out to all the wonderful people out there who have sent me things. I need to send something to Karen and Brian, to Valerie and Chris, and I need to send something to October Rain Rocks as well. All these lovely people who have been sending me bits and pieces, I need to return the favour. So, to as do we go for some padded envelopes. How exciting does my life get? Now folks, today's shout out goes to a chap called Jimmy Young. Jimmy started to follow me, so thank you Jimmy, and uh, I do watch your videos as well. You seem to be doing the same sort of thing as what we do, so it's awesome. I've just given your sister a badge for you, Jimmy, a spiz badge. She'll be giving you that next time she sees you, I suppose. But thanks, Jimmy, for following us. Keep up the good work, mate, and uh, hopefully I'll bump into you one day, Jimmy. Right, today's guests in the vlog, we have Wendy in the vlog and we have Wayne the Pain. You want to be in the vlogs today, folks? How do you put up with Wendy, Wayne? I do not know, but I suppose the two of you are kind of suited. Look, <laughs> look at that. <laughs> Wonderful. See you in the vlog. Oh, no, folks. We have traffic, 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 traffic jam. Dundee at this time of night, man. What's going on? Yeah, so I appear to be stuck in a bit of traffic here, folks, just coming along the uh, the Arbroath Road. It's very unusual to be stuck in such heavy traffic at this time of day. I don't know what's going on. I just want to get home. I want to chill out with a beer. Cook tea. See my lovely wife. But mostly chill with a beer. And good evening, welcome to Jag's Kitchen, where tonight I'm going to show you how to make a stir-fry, but in the Jag style. This is the one I always cook, and it never fails to impress the guests. The guest is always Rosie the wife. Now, first of all, may I please uh, say that you should use this. This is Sharwood's Sweet and Sour Stir-Fry Melt. We always use these. This one's sweet and sour. The one we're going to be using tonight is sweet chilli. You also get shizzes, shizzwan, or whatever it's called, uh, chow mein, and a couple of other ones as well. But uh, tonight we're going to be using sweet chilli. These are fantastic. Much better than a sauce. It's not watery at all. It's a big, it's like a stock cube. It just lobs in and you waft it around and it, it melts and it makes the vegetables a lot more crunchy. So use Sharwood's recommended. Thank you. Ingredients, uh, chicken. Chop up your chicken, an onion, mushrooms, and peppers. 
normally we have broccoli but for some reason we don't have broccoli and also in the box we have cashew nuts that's it so that's your uh, main ingredients and also you do need some soy sauce as well I'll show you what to do with that in a minute now the noodles we will be using tonight uh once again Sharwoods uh medium egg noodles now medium egg noodles have that they're a bit thicker they're, well obviously they are thicker than fine noodles the extra thick ones are too thick so f medium noodles they add a bit more meat and a bit more um to your stir fry yeah there it is. right folks here we go now I, I don't mean to insult your intelligence by saying you know showing you how to make a, a stir fry because it is it's just what you want to put in it basically everything's just the same you know you just stir fry it so what we've done here we've got everything just frying nicely here but i always like to put a touch of um soya sauce over mine and what soya sauce does is it just sort of brings everything together and it gives it this this wonderful brown sort of color and the aroma and it does it just seems to make everything a little bit more crunchy as well so there we go, look at that, I mean, look. Look at that, lovely. We're throwing the cashew nuts in there as well. So that's the chicken, the onions, mushrooms, and the cashew nuts. And then what I'll do is I'll put the uh, the peppers will go in just at the very end. Because uh, you want the peppers to remain crunchy. You don't want them too soft and soggy. The noodles, well, the noodles, as you can see, are uh, they're just sort of sitting in boiling water, really. So, um, and they'll be ready. You don't want them overcooked or undercooked as well. So, we're very ready. We will, yes, <laughs> we will be very ready. Oh my goodness me! I think that vodka has gone to my head. I've had a, I've had two vodka and coke. So now we've uh, we put the peppers in, and as you can see, like that big blob. That is the uh, sweet and sour, uh, the sweet and sour, the uh, sweet chilli sauce, the Sharwood's thing. So that's just going to, now that'll just, you can see, just poke it around and let it cook in there. And I'll just confuse. So we're almost ready. There we go. Mm, looking good. Yeah, see how things get nice and glazed now? Here it is, folks, the final article. Sweet chili stir fry. Oh, yeah. Proud of that. Excellent. 